Hello everyone, so I've just got to Specsavers where I'm going to get my impressions done, moulds will be finished, then I can use those to get my in-air monitors done. So yeah, I'm going to show you the process. So guys, we're going to get some explanation as to what these are. Okay, so we've got the impression material, we have a base and we have a catalyst, so when the two are mixed together, they harden in the air so we can get a nice impression of the air canal. Nice one. One eternity later. Yo, yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Seath Music. Carlon Ferguson is currently on your screen. If this is your first time visiting the channel, please feel free to like, subscribe, comment and share. Hit me up in the social media. Snapchat is Carlon123. Instagram, Facebook and Twitter is at Seath Music. Now today, I will be getting my impressions taken, hopefully. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to include this particular footage, but uh, last week, uh, a little bit over last week, tried to get them done. So yeah, going to be getting my impressions taken, and I'm currently heading to Specsavers. So let's see how this process goes. What's up everyone? So obviously you're not used to hearing my voice, but not seeing me. Uh, first attempt at doing a voiceover. I uh, know you're not used to it, but first time for everything. Now, I'm literally just gonna walk you through this footage because I figured, you know what, it'd be best if I had some music in the background and just literally walk you through what's going through my head and what's happening. So, let's see how things go. Now, as you can see, we got the like pastes and stuff, whatever the thing is called that they use. And they used the two of those, mixed them together like Play-Doh. And then you see, the ch uh, okay, so at the moment, uh, what's happening is my ears are just getting like a final check. Gotta be safe, gotta be safe, you know? But yeah, as I was saying, what happens is they mix these two substances together and that's what they actually inject. So I think we've got like a final check going on because um, what just happened was there was like a sort of cotton thing. I don't know what the material is that's installed into the ear so that when they mix this play-doh like material you can then actually extract the impression after it's been taken so yeah now yeah, tubing i guess you could call it tubing so yeah look at that look at that purple wonderful color anyone whose favorite color is purple feel free to let me know in the comment section my favorite color is red but you know you know purple's still good now at this point, this was a really cold material, man. Okay, you see it filling up my ears, literally. Like, you just feel it go all the way down the injection. And prior to this, I actually had um, a professional wax removal, literally just done about five minutes before this had happened. So my ears were super clean. So now I've literally just got to stay still, chill. And it, it's like you just lose hearing. Like, it, it, imagine someone just putting a muffler on your ears and I decided, you know what, let me turn to the camera, I'll show you guys what's happening. Got this like uneven thing. Ooh, time to turn, time to turn, turn boy, turn! Yeah, you and your bad arm healing up, still turning, all good, all good. So yeah, it's time to do the next day. So yeah, obviously that same material I was telling you about, where they like stick that in, and guys, apologies for the camera angle. I didn't really have much to work with and everything was quite short notice in terms of like filming. Either way, you can see, check in, making sure everything's all good. And to be honest, shout out to Specsavers. Honestly, like they're, they're brilliant. If you want to get your impressions done, literally call them up, explain to them your reasons. They do a great job, great job. So yeah, getting those checks done, gotta be safe. And at this point, I can't lie, I didn't know what to feel. I was just, just closing my eyes at points, opening my eyes. So once again, we got the mixing of the two substances. And what actually happens before COVID, the audiologist could literally just rub this material, these materials between them, I mean, between their plain hands, but because of COVID, gotta wear gloves and apron and stuff. So social distancing measures and stuff time for the next injection now at this point i'll be honest with you people i couldn't hear i couldn't hear a blessed thing man like literally because 
obviously this is designed to travel all like down the ear canal and just so you people know i have very small ears like all my life i've had small ears even the audiologist said you got very small ear canals but don't worry my ears are healthy and she even confirmed my ear canals are healthy so it's all good and if some of you are wondering what's the point of this video the whole reason why um, i was going through this process is because i'm planning on getting myself in-ear monitors because i've been drumming for 17 years guys i gotta make sure i keep my hearing solid I'm not trying to have bad ears in the future so at the moment she's trying to get my attention and i can't hear her like it, it, it sounded like she was 100 floors below me trying to shout but like quietly shout i can't describe it imagine i almost took it out myself because i thought she was trying to tell me take it out but nah okay so she's just checked to make sure it's hard and it was weird look at my eyes look at well look at what happens to me i'm telling you i can't describe this feeling <laughs> when they when it's getting removed so yeah that's the shape of my ear shape of my right ear right there and i can't i can't describe this feeling you know i just thought to myself yeah you know what yeah let me show you guys let me show you so a little little view of that nice little view nice little eardrum right there not eardrum ear canal either way you people know what i'm talking about and a final check we're gonna make sure that there's no none of the substance left in my ears i guess and make sure the ears are still okay and yeah I know that the tissue was offered to help me wipe my ears, but I even said to her, it's hard to know if my ears are clean or wipe them out if like I can't see my ears after this process, but it's all good. It's all good. Now, here's the thing. What she done was when she done the last impression, thank you very much. She gave me like the leftover, I guess you could call it filling, whatever it is. But basically these two substances by themselves, perfectly fine. But once you mix them together, you got about five, maybe six minutes max to get that material down the patient's ears because it then just hardens. Like it starts off as Play-Doh, actually smells pretty nice. By the way, guys, obviously don't make a habit of smelling this. I, I, in fact, I haven't even smelled it myself. It's my mom who smelled it. But either way, literally, you could make any shape you wanted. And after I realized that it actually got hard, I thought to myself, wow, I should have made like a cube or something, but you win some, you lose some, hey ho. I was still obviously waiting for the final impression to just be finished, just talking back and forth. I gotta admit, it was, it was actually pretty chill, pretty chill. Oh, and guys, in case you hadn't noticed, this was basically my third attempt at trying to get my in-ears done, well, get my impressions done, because initially, that was just, it just couldn't happen the first time I went. Couldn't happen the second time I went. And then third time I went, I was just like, look, this has to happen. Because guys, make sure you never use cotton buds. Unless you're wiping like the outer of your ear, you got like an itch. Do not put cotton buds in your ears. Oh, I decided to show you guys my leftover. <laughs> yeah, my leftover filling or whatever the thing is called. Now it is time to remove i was about to say third impression it's not like i have three years the second impression so the one in the left ear she taps it make sure it's all good move out gently or however it needs to be taken out and boom bing bada boom bada bing ba boom ba boom and yeah she's got to check my ear honestly safety oh it's brilliant uncanny in fact is that the right word to use i'm not too certain Someone, someone let me know. But yeah, wipe out my ears. Nothing came out because my ears were brand spanking clean after like the wax removal. So yeah, here's what my ears look like. Well, the inside. And then I'd said, you know what? Let me show you guys the shape that I made. I, I don't know what you could describe that shape, but yeah, left and right. And then a final goodbye sort of thank you from me. So yeah, I just decided to take some pictures for you guys in between. Yeah, just try to get some angles. If anyone's thinking about getting their impressions taken, trust me, go do it. Your ears matter. Like in 30 years time, you're going to thank yourself that your ears are like where they should be in life. Oh, I've got some nice shots coming. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, left and right should be obvious to see. And then I just said, you know what, let me swivel this round and take multiple angles 
Yeah. Yeah. I think that's the final photo. Or maybe there's one more. Yeah. That's probably the final photo. So yeah, guys. That actually brings us to the end of the video. I'm hoping you enjoyed. And yeah. Um, I'm planning to continue this process. Um, when I feel, you know what, it's necessary to get myself some proper in-ears done. Because that's the whole point of me getting the impressions. I will literally keep you guys on track along that journey. But until then, I will see you in the next video. Once again, hoping you've enjoyed. Please feel free to show your love, your support. Like, subscribe, comment and share. And I will catch you in the next one. Till then, take care of yourselves. God bless. And also, if you want to see, well, hear any more voiceovers, I'll try and think about any more content where I could actually do them. Uh, but yeah, let me know if you want to get more of these. So yeah, once again, guys, take care of yourselves. God bless. See you all. We out.